Okay, so I just stumbled upon this deep seek OCR model, and it's all about how we can rethink vision encoders in relation to large language models. Wait seriously, vision encoders and language models, that sounds like a curious blend. How do those two even connect? Right, it's fascinating. They're using visual text compression to enhance how these models understand images. So it's like they want the models to comprehend visuals in the same way they process text. That's pretty innovative. Exactly, but here's the kicker. It might redefine our expectations of machine learning applications in OCR. OCR, meaning optical character recognition, right. I wonder what limitations they might face trying to merge these fields. Good point, they've set support for different resolutions, like tiny and dynamic, but still I'm skeptical about how it handles intricate images. That's interesting. Do they provide any examples of how it works with complex visuals? Yeah, they offer prompts like converting documents to markdown and even parsing figures, but I wonder how accurate it really is. I see, it seems ambitious, but doesn't that assume the model can fully grasp contextual nuances in images? Exactly, plus the performance benchmarks are impressive, but we should be cautious about overhyping it without real world testing. For sure, and think about edge cases. What about images with overlapping text or intricate backgrounds? How would that pan out? That's crucial. They mention performance with up to 2,500 tokens per second for PDFs. That sounds impressive, but makes me wonder about data quality. True, it raises questions about how it processes different data types. Is speed prioritized over accuracy? Good observation. This makes me curious about how adaptable it is across various document types. Totally. We should also consider the broader implications of using such technology in everyday applications, right? Absolutely. Imagine integrating this into apps that require quick data extraction, but what happens with sensitive data? That's a critical concern. Privacy issues could easily become a hot topic if it doesn't handle data responsibly. Totally. It's like walking a tightrope between innovation and ethical considerations. We can't overlook that. Exactly. And the fact that they're aiming for an open source model adds another layer. It's exciting yet daunting. True, open source can drive adoption, but it also opens the door for misuse. That's a double-edged sword. For sure. So if it's successful, how might it change industries that rely heavily on OCR technology? Great question. Think about education, libraries, even medical records. Enhanced OCR could revolutionize accessibility. Right but I think we need to tread carefully to avoid relying too heavily on automated systems. Human oversight is still essential. Definitely, there's a balance to strike between automation and human touch. I wonder how they'll address that. That will be key. Also, I'm curious about the benchmarks they've provided. Are there any comparisons to existing models? Good point, they do mention some benchmarks, but I feel like a side-by-side -side analysis with competitors could shed more light. Exactly. And I wonder about the community's response. Are developers excited or skeptical about integrating this into their projects? It's a mixed bag. Some are thrilled about the possibilities, while others are cautious about its reliability. That makes sense. It's always a challenge to balance enthusiasm for innovation with genuine practicality. Right. And what do you think about the potential for this technology to democratize access to information? That's an optimistic angle. If it works as intended, it could empower many who struggle with traditional OCR tools. Absolutely, but I still worry about the digital divide. Not everyone has the same access to technology. True, we can't ignore that. Maybe the developers need to consider how to bridge that gap during deployment. Exactly, and as we explore these advancements, ethical frameworks must keep pace with the technology. Spot on. It's crucial for guiding responsible innovation. I'm really curious how they'll tackle these challenges moving forward. Totally, it feels like we're on the cusp of something big, but the path ahead is complex. And that's what makes it so fascinating. We need to keep an eye on its evolution and impact. For sure, I think leaving our listeners with a question, how do we balance innovation with ethics in AI? Exactly. It's a heavy but necessary conversation as we dive deeper into these technologies.